بسم الله الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله الطلب الأعزاء السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته وأهلا ومرحبا بكم في هذا الجزء الثالث من المحاضرة الأولى بالمحور الرابع والتي بعنوان Kinds of Sections So many kinds of sections are present in engineering drawing The first one is called full section Second offset section Third one half section broken out section, revolved section aligned, and removed section, this is detailed section called also. We will start by full section view. The view is made by passing the straight cutting plane completely through the part. Here we have the part. These are original views using dashed line. If we take the plane here, cross section a plane, okay, it pass through all the part and make the section. This is called full section view, and we'll get finally the sectional view here with dashed lines. Offset section view. The view is made by passing the the bended cutting plane completely through the part. Here we have an example. <coughs> Sorry, these are original views by using dashed lines. This is the bended cutting plane, it passes through all the parts and makes section. Finally, we'll get section of view using dashed line or hatching, called also hatching. Here, these Intersections with with sections here will not be represented here. Do not show the edges view of the cutting plane. These lines should not be shown. It will be removed. Treatment of hidden lines. Hidden lines are normally omitted from section views. We have an example here. These are original uh, views. If we make section, okay, we'll get dashed uh, section uh, view uh, section lines with hatching. So dashed line should be removed on the sectional view. Half section of view. The view is made by passing the cutting plane halfway through an object and remove a quarter of it. We have an example here. These are original views. We have to remove a quarter of this object like this. Okay. How it will be represented? Okay, this is the section line. A center line is used to separate the sectioned half from the unsectioned half of the view. This is center line here. Okay, we have here. Hidden line is omitted in unsectioned half of the view. We can see here, this is the half section, and this half of the part is still not sectioned. And hidden lines are removed from here. Broken out section of view. The view is made by passing the cutting plane normal to the, view, to the viewing direction and removing the, uh, the portion of an object in front of it. Here we have an example. This is original views. This is a cutting plane. We make now the broken out section to show a detail here. How to represent it? It will be represented by using uh, hand drawing line. Uh, 
okay we want to show these details it will be view from here and still all dashed line hidden lines still present on the view A break line is used to separate the sectioned portion from uh, the unsectioned portion of the view. This is a break line. Okay. Break line is a thin continuous line 4H drawn by a 4H pencil and it's, it is drawn freehand. Also, there is no cutting plane line for this type of section. One example, comparison about among several section techniques. With the same part, here we have full sectional view. So with the same part also, this is half sectional view. And here, it is broken out sectional view. We can see the details here in all sectional viewers. Revolved section of view. Revolved sections show cross-sectional features of a part. There is no need for additional orthographic views. This section is especially helpful when a cross-section varies. Here an example. The basic concept of revolved section of view is the following. We have an example, this part. This portion is cylindrical. Here we have the shape of a hexagon. Okay. If we make a section here, what we have to do, we have to take a section and make it revolved around it as its axis and put it again on the same view here. It is revolved about this axis. Steps in construction given that are this part. If we make a section view here, we start by assign a portion of cutting plane. Here the cutting plane. We assign the portion here. Next, we have to draw the axis of rotation in front of you. Here is the axis of rotation for revolving. Okay. These are edges of view of cross section. After that, step two, we have to transfer the depth dimension to the front view. Okay. Depth dimensions are transferred to the, to the front view here. After that, step three, we have to draw the revolved section like that. The, this is the, the cross section. It will be revolved here. Finally, we have to add section lines. This is the final picture with revolved section of view. Placement of revolved section. For this example, it will be a superimposed to the orthographic view. Here, on the same view, but revolved. It can be break from orthographic view. Here, for example, we make a break, a little break, and draw it, revolve it for this hexagon cross-sectional shape. Remove it section now. Remove it section is a revolved section too. Section view is shown outside the view and used where space does not enough for a revolved section and can be located elsewhere on a drawing with a properly labeled. Here an example. These are revolved sections. 
and here we can make removed sections you can see here this section removed from the original view and put it outside the view it is called removed section this one also it can be put it outside the original view another example here if we put this section only revolved the view it, it is not clear here too messy what we have to do we have to make it removed section we have to put it outside the original view now it is okay very clear another example for for remove it section for this one okay this is the first section remove it next one another section it will be removed too and properly labeled this is bb section okay and this is one this one is aa section